Welcome to 42 Sun Circle. You're located just outside of Collin Ranch. And when you think class, when you think luxury, you think Collin Ranch. This home is located in Reno's Old Southwest, and it is situated at the end of a long private driveway, and it is zoned for horse property. This beautiful remodeled home sits on over an acre. This home has been completely remodeled with beautiful upgrades about five years ago. In part of the remodeling of the interior of this home, we have a upgraded kitchen with granite, and they put in a lot of oversized windows to take advantage of all the views and of the private backyard. And in the remodel that was done about five years ago, they created a nice, beautiful open floor plan with the living room, the kitchen, and the formal dining room all in the same space. You have a deck right off the kitchen with a view over the backyard. How cool is that? It also has an oversized three-car garage. It's just over 3,200 square feet and it is a two-story. Now the master is on the main level as well as the laundry room and I know that those are pluses for a lot of people. Downstairs is super kid friendly. There's a playroom, they have another media room, so while everybody is relaxing upstairs, the kids are down doing their own little thing. There is a hot tub here as well and it stays with the home. Now this home is ideal for people that want space, they want privacy, and they want a seasonal stream in the backyard. How cool is that? That's on a lot of people's wish lists. This home has it. Follow me, let's take the actual tour. All right, come on inside. Okay, welcome inside. Do you want to mention that as soon as you walk in, there's a coat closet and half a bath right here, and I'll show you a picture of that. But I want to talk about this amazing open floor plan. We have a stove here, and I think, personally, I love a stove over a fireplace. Living room, obviously, um, but look at these custom windows that were installed. They're really oversized to take advantage of the mountain views. You're on over an acre. So you can see the seasonal stream, you have a view of the yard itself, and you have a view of the deck right off of the kitchen door, and we'll get there. I do want to point out before we get to show the rest of this room that this is the master bedroom on the main level, but we'll get there. I want to show you this beautiful kitchen and dining room. One thing to note about the windows is that you'll see the bottom is where the windows open up because they wanted to have this uh, nice, beautiful, uninterrupted view. There are screens here and they're metal and they're welded to the actual uh, window itself so that when the windows are open, no one's, no one's going out the bottom of those. So just a, an added feature to let you know how much care was, uh, was taken to do uh, when they did the remodel to this home. So here in this open floor plan, we have the kitchen, which is absolutely beautiful. Again, remodeled about five years ago. And we have the formal dining room. So all the activity can be happening right here in the main room. I also do want to mention that you have a elevated counter so that you can just go ahead and pull up some bar stools and hang out with whoever's in trouble and doing the dishes or just making a fantastic meal. We have these really cool Edison bulb accent lighting. Here would be the pantry and I'd like to talk about the Samsung top of the line stainless steel appliances. Microwave, we have a dual gas oven as well as a five burner gas top. It's worth pointing out the accent lighting under these cabinets that are all soft close. Oh, nobody likes to pinch their fingers. And up above, to add some more natural light to this house, is two skylights. We have the blinds drawn on them though, but they are there and they add a lot of light into this kitchen. But how cool is this? When you are preparing your meals and you're ready to entertain, oh man, you just walk right outside this door and you are on your deck. So right off the kitchen, you're bringing food straight out and you're enjoying the peace and quiet. Let's continue. This door here is to that oversized three car garage. And with it being an oversized garage, you have plenty of room for all of those summer projects. And coming back into the wide open floor plan here, 
Right out the garage door is the laundry room, which is on the main level. How cool is that? I know that's a big plus for a lot of people. Stairs. Here's where you'll find them that go downstairs and, uh, and we'll get there. So let's go see the master. The master bedroom, you also have these oversized windows. You have a door that leads you off to a private, uh, private deck. The master closet is this nice frosted glass. I'm just gonna open it real quick and then we'll just close it real quick. It is California style and there is plenty of shelving for all of her shoes. Let's go see the master bathroom. In the master bathroom, we do have a tub shower combination with marble tile. And we have oil rub bronze everything in this bathroom. This cabinet is absolutely beautiful. So I don't know, I'm ready to go see downstairs because it's a lot of fun. You ready? Let's go. Here we are at the staircase that's gonna lead us downstairs. We have a security gate and it's not one of those baby gates, those wood things that you put up. This is actually, a, this is an actual security gate that matches the rails of the staircase. So, okay, let's go downstairs. And before we get downstairs, I just want to point this out. I think it's a really cool idea. The seller hung clipboards. And so whenever the seller wants to see different pictures, just boom, boom, new pictures. Okay, so downstairs, we have a door that leads you out to the patio, direct access to that stream. I'm gonna hit that zip line here in a little bit, but this room right here is a perfect playroom. If you wanna call it a craft room, just a place where the kids can hang out. Um, this closet here is a really large closet that goes under the stairs, so there's plenty of storage here. So while the kids are down here making noise and while the adults are just relaxing upstairs, that looks cool. We have a media room downstairs. This here is a pony wall. It is the fourth bedroom. So if you do want to make this space larger, this pony wall can come right out. This fourth bedroom can also be used as an office. And in matching with the home, we do have a frosted glass closet as well. Okay, let's go see the other bedrooms. I'm telling you, I am tempted. <laughs> that looks cool. Okay, right here we have a full bathroom. The full bathroom has dual sinks and it has really, really beautiful glass tiled bathtub shower combo. And coming out of the bathroom, here is a second of the three bedrooms located downstairs. Coming out of the second bedroom, that's uh, two of the three that are downstairs, let's walk into the third bedroom. The third bedroom has oversized windows looking out into that beautiful backyard. Sorry folks, that chandelier is not staying. That's, uh, <laughs> that's a really nice chandelier from Italy, it's going. And it also has this alcove here for a vanity. Let's go see the backyard proper, follow me. So you have that door off the kitchen that will lead you onto the deck in the back, but you have a door here off of the kids' playroom. And you walk out into this really, really cool patio. The seasonal stream. You can listen how quiet it is. Again, this is horse property. If you have horses, great. If not, that's okay with me too. The hot tub is a Catalina spa and it stays with the house. Over an acre, over an acre, over an acre. This is what it sounds like to be on over an acre. This is how beautiful it is. So right here, the seasonal stream kind of comes in and this turns into a pond in the uh, spring and summertime. Really cool. And it flows through, we've got a couple bridges. I'm just gonna walk this way just for a bit and just kind of show you what it feels like to be living on just over an acre. Coming back towards the house. <laughs> There's the dog run. It's really, an, it's an oversized dog run. They even have a fire hydrant in there, <laughs> which I think is really cool. 
And I'm really looking at this zip line. I don't know if I have it in me. This is that deck off of the master bedroom and that's private deck. This is that deck that comes right off of that kitchen door. And then here you just have wide open grass, uh, manicured lawn, sprinklers in front and back. This works. A tree house. And I don't know if I'm gonna go in there or not. All right, I probably will. A swing, I'm not gonna do that though because there's snow on it. And a trampoline. So this home is ready for, uh, for guests with kids just to have an absolute blast. Let's now talk about this kitchen. First thing I want to point out is that you can scoot up some bar stools up to this beautiful sandstone granite countertop. So, so. What'd I say? Sandstone. No one knows the difference. <laughs> There's my blooper reel right there. Okay. <laughs> 